And I'm glad that this person wrote a blog so we don't have to figure that out too much ourselves. Mm -hmm. And um, that way I can tr experience running it with Anthropic. And last time we left off uh, through prompt engineering, we got it to uh, produce code without encapsulating it in backticks. Mm. Uh, and we still need to test if the uh, Python REPL tool from Langchain will uh, function without error now. So I want to I want to do the bedrock. I want to test out the Python REPL. Um, we should uh, confirm that the context is working uh, from task one to task two, uh, mm -hmm. and then have completed the uh, goals uh, for for this stretch. Um, I want to see your visualization. And I also want to discuss um, maybe having a, a slightly different format, because um, you mentioned it would be good to also do more of the theoretical. You had mentioned Emily Weber. Um, uh, so Emily wrote like the book on pre-training large language models. Mm, cool. um, yeah, this is the book. Mm -hmm. um, it would be cool to use that. I'll ask her for permission if we can just go through the whole thing on live stream um, because it would just be cool to read a book where we have a connection to the author and can ask her follow-up questions directly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sounds great. <clears throat> awesome.